guys, it's me, DSP, and today I'll be making slime on a mountain. So here you can see this mountain. It's not that high up. It's 1,800, like 36 feet tall. And um, so yeah, but it's so that's how tall we are. It's not that tall up. Here I have my bowl or a container and I have baking soda in it. And here I have um, four ounces of Elmer School glue. I have a spoon, same solution, and paint to color my slime green. So we're gonna go ahead and start with our um, school glue. Actually what I'm gonna do is so my baking soda was sitting. So I'm actually gonna kinda get it like off the container. It's just kind of sticking to the container. Sorry if there's any background noise if there are like that. So now I'm gonna add my glue into my container. And I'm trying to get most of it in. Comment down below if you ever made slime on a mountain. All right, it got, I think most, I got most of the glue I would say. I have a bit of glue, I'll probably get that maybe at the end. So now I'm gonna mix up the glue and the baking soda. I'm gonna mix it for a, a little bit longer than I normally do because I do have baking soda in it and it was on the bottom so I'm gonna try to get I'm trying to see you can see I'm trying to scrape down and kind of fold it in let's see scrape the sides so I did get a lot of baking soda on the sides I think that's good so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add in my paint and it's green paint so now I'm gonna add in my paint all right, now I'm gonna add in my green paint. Sorry about the vector noises. So now I'm gonna go ahead and mix up the paint. I think I want this to be like a light green. All right guys, so I got the green paint mixed up and it actually looks really good. So now I'm gonna go ahead and activate the slime. So I got some saline solution. This is a smaller size because I'm gonna be making slime on a travel. You can see, I do have some videos of making slime. Actually just one video making slime in a different place. So yeah, start to activate the slime. It's just easier to have a smaller saline bottle. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, click the bell, and like my videos because I actually have some cool videos coming up in the future. So now you can see, we can actually get a closer view of the slime. You can see how it's sticking off of the sides of the bowl. But we won't need more seeding because it is still really sticky. And comment down below video ideas because I don't really have a lot of video ideas. I'm just kind of trying to make it up, but it's kind of hard to make up. So give me video ideas and I will actually give you a shout out. So in the video idea, in the video I make your video idea, I will give you a shout out. So yeah. So think of the idea and you'll get a shout out. Alright, let's see how that is. I think I am gonna go with my hands, obviously. Let's see, it is still sticky, but I think it will be. I think it will be good to have it a bit stickier. It still doesn't like. Cause if it's really hard, it's just a bad slime, and I'd rather have a sticky slime than a hard slime, cause I can always activate the um, slime. We'll add a bit of saline. Go mix it. All up. I'm gonna mix this up and I'll be back. All right guys, so I added a little bit more activator and it is activated. I'm actually surprised. I feel like I do need more activator with this saline solution, but I don't know. But it's still really good slime. Ready, I can poke, you poke it. Not the best, I have to do a saline in a container. So it's not the best slime because I don't have lotion in it, but I'm on a mountain, so how much lotion could I possibly have? But yeah, that's going to be it for the video, and I'll see you in the next video. Again, I'm DSP.